eight, seven, six, five, four. Command start. Two, one. Cleared the tower. There you have it, a spectacular launch of New Shepard, live from West Texas. Five seconds is when we'll see our escape. There it is, 70,000 pounds of thrust pushing that crew capsule at 400 miles an hour. And the V3 engine remains on, the booster continues to space. There it is, a clean firing in the solid rocket motor. The drogues are out on the crew capsule. Those mains should those mains should follow shortly. The, propul the booster remains nominal. It's at 39,000 feet and climbing. We lost the aerodynamic benefit of the crew capsule. Up. Oh. And there go the mains. Okay, so those three mains are reefed right now to keep them small. The reefing will remove shortly to fully expand, as you can see. All three mains. There you go, full inflation. Like I was mentioning earlier, we actually have to throttle down the engine as soon as the escape happens because what happens is, while you lost the aerodynamic benefit of the capsule, you also lost 8,000 pounds. And so if we kept going with our full propellant load at full thrust, we'd actually overboost and go even deeper into space. But let's focus back on the crew capsule. That's right. You see the hills of West Texas in your screen. and touchdown of the new Shepard crew capsule. From what we can tell, that was a nominal in-flight test of our escape system. And again, all astronauts on board would have had a pretty exhilarating ride, but a safe ride. Absolutely. Now that is a robust system, Phil. Absolutely. All right, so the booster has just- Keeps the rocket upright as it's coming into, as it's coming into land. Correct, the ring fin shifts the center of pressure backwards and we're about 12 seconds out from those wedge fins deploying. Precise, soft landing. All right, so drag brakes have fully deployed. Let's wait for that BE-3 engine to fire. And watch that speed falling pretty dramatically. she goes. Look at that. Nice and stable. Landing gear deploying. There you go. The boosters are in that tail of the wire. Beautiful. Wow. There it is. Touchdown. What an extraordinary test and a tremendous final flight for both craft. As we'd very optimistically aimed for, both our crew capsule successfully execute, executed its in-flight escape test and the booster brilliantly continued to space and came home for a fifth landing on our landing pad just two miles north of where it took off from. On behalf of the hardworking team at Blue Origin, Thank you all for joining us today for this live broadcast of our New Shepard test flight. If you're interested in learning more and keeping up to date on our progress, be sure and sign up for our on our website for email updates. This is going to conclude our exciting live web stream from here in West Texas. Phil, a big thank you to you. Thank you, Ariane. Anytime. I, this was amazing. I, I just want to take a minute and just send a special thanks out to our Blue Origin team across the country. Your hard work, your diligence, your effort has paid off wonderfully and made the, the vehicle and system we have today. Thank you. Thank you so much.